Hi, we continue the cycle of videos of how to get ultra-precise prosthetic work. In the previous series we talked about gypsum and models made of it, and today polyurethane and epoxy. Let's try to figure out which is better. In the meantime, we want to remind you that we have an application, in which videos about photo protocols and abstraction is now available at an affordable price. And let's start with the physical properties. Polyurethane and epoxy are much more resistant to gypsum wear and chipping a fine line on polyurethane is not as easy as on a gypsum. Polyurethanes are macromolecular compounds containing macromolecules in the main chain, urethane groups. The composition of the polyurethane material for the models includes a base, an aliphatic polyester polyol and hardener. The polyisocyanate consists of diphenylmethane diisocyanate. Sequential polymerization proceeds through the synthesis of polyol and polyisocyanate. In parallel with the fusion reaction, there is a second reaction of the isocyanate compound with water from the environment, in which an unstable compound is produced, which releases carbon dioxide during decomposition. Therefore, in the polyurethane model, under magnification, you might notice porosity on the surface. But if after filling the impression install it in a special chamber under pressure, then porosity can be practically avoided. According to studies, polyurethane is much stronger than gypsum. It reproduces detail of an impression of 1-2 micron in size, which means it can accurately display the surface if the doctor is not sure of the ideality of his preparation, and may, for example, a concave finishing line, and the restoration will be made as precise as possible. Compared with other materials, polyurethane has the biggest shrinkage, but when recalculating this shrinkage on a 5 mm surface, this change in size in the case of gypsum is about 1.55 microns, and for polyurethane already two times bigger, 2.8 microns, which of course will not be seen by any technician or doctor in their microscopes. The working time is about 2-3 minutes and the final polymerization in 1.5 hours, and you can immediately work, while for recommendation on the time of the working for his gypsum see our videos. A model made of polyurethane can also be treated with a steam jet and antiseptic, without affecting its dimensional stability. The disadvantage of the polyurethane material for model is the high cost and the short life cycle of open package of material due to the self-hardening of the components in the package. Therefore, the casting of such models for single crowns is not profitable. Another disadvantage is the connection with polyether impression materials. Epoxy resins. Epoxy resins, a synthetic resin, a polycondensation product of epichlorhydrin with phenols, with bisphenol hardener. An exemplary composition of the epoxy plastic in parts by weight is given below. Very comfortable walking time. For a large laboratory you can immediately cast a lot of impressions, but the final cure within 8-8 10 hours. Spatial change is particularly no different from gypsum. The wear-resistant surface allows you to fit work on it a huge number of times. It is very hard to abrade. You can say the ideal materials for the model, but is rarely used by technicians because of the harmful components in the composition, hazardous by inhalation, if swallowed and in contact with skin. And for those who still work with resins, a number of sources tells that bisphenol affects the reproductive organs in women and the prostate in men. But this question requires further study. Let's summarize. We produce gypsum models with perfect preparation, work on implants and accurate technician for the manufacture of small single restorations or bridges, and simply because the cheap model has sufficient accuracy. Polyurethane models should be cast if the preparation is not as perfect as planned. In our opinion, it is reasonable to use polyurethane for large works. The clinic director will be able to spend money for two models, cast from epoxy if work in a well-equipped laboratory, or if you do not value your health and no longer want children. Health to all, bye.